Hello and welcome to Marriage Unchained, The Art of One Flesh. We've spent a few lessons together and I wanted to chime in and to make sure that you don't fall into the trap of pride and um, the refusal to listen. Um, so many marriages over the years, I've seen them where the couples go and wait till things are so bad because this doesn't happen fast. It's a slow process. But many couples wait until things are so bad that all of a sudden they go in chaos mode and they want to run out and try to get advice from all these crazy people that don't know what the heck they're talking about. Well, I'm here to let you know that many of us, I don't want you to do that. I, I, I don't want you as the man of the household to wait um, until the last second when your wife's ready to walk out the door and you just are disgusted by her and all of a sudden now, oh, I want to save my family or, um, you know, I want to do this or do that. Well, we don't want to wait to that long. Um, in fact, the Holy Spirit in pla places, um, through the Holy Spirit, God places um, the answers to our questions and our problems in front of us every day. Um, and those answers usually come in the form of someone um, standing in front of you and spilling what the Holy Spirit needs and is asking of you. And that's the answer to your problem. But a lot of times we're distracted. We don't listen. We're we have a lot of anger or we're upset or we just don't care. We come to the point where we just don't care. But God speaks to us every day, especially in our marriages, because to him, marriage is special it's a sacrament and he needs us to understand and to um to keep that bond intact with our wives um for instance one time i gave a friend a book and because he was complaining to me about his marriage and his wife of course everybody complains about their wives nobody wants to look at themselves we always want to fix our wives first or it's always someone else's fault well I, gave, I had read a book and I knew I was a thousand percent sure that this book would help him. And so I went and bought the book and we took it. I took it over his house and I put the book in his hand and I told him, I said, look, man, this is the Holy Spirit telling you the answer to your problems right here. This is it. If you use this book, read it and cultivate it. I said, You're, you will go a long way into you know answering your problems. And of course, being a man, what did he do? It took him forever, but he finally read the book and things started getting better. So what's my point? You're here for a reason. Um, the father has placed me in front of you, in essence, to provide you with a choice to accept or deny his help. Um, how long or is your... Are you going to have your beloved wait? How long must she wait for you to protect her, to, to suffer for her, to defend her, to serve her? Um, in short, to take action. So what I'm asking you today is to persevere, Christian soldier. Don't wait any longer. Contact me. Um... And together we can do this. And um, our time together is almost over. And um, so I want to put wanted to put this spell into you so that you would know that I'm still here and I'm ready to help you. So as again, this is Jerry Jacobs. Marriage Unchanged, the art of one flesh. Contact me now.